Raider Nation, it's your boy Graphic Raider Man, back with another quick video, the views expressed here on Graphic Podcast. Welcome to the black hole of Raiders YouTube, y'all. Victory Monday, it feels sweet. Let's get to these unsung hero and these game balls, y'all. DC, QB1, it's the first game ball. Statistically, I know nothing really stands out outside of the two TDs. He was 13 for 23, 165 yards passing. Like I said, two TDs, two rushes for 14 yards. One of them was big on third and 10. And, you know, we all know the dive. Also, look, man, DC is extending plays with his legs. He had two big passes, one to Aguilar that was a perfect pass, perfect touch on the ball for a TD that was a momentum-changing play of the game. Another big a pass to Renfro. Oh, my God, you can't get any better than that. That was literally a perfect pass. And he, he extended that play with his legs. He was calling for him downfield. You just love to see our quarterback. He is in his zone right now, y'all. Ah, man, it's the same. He did have one big, one big, 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 big problem, though. At the end of the half, he fumbled the ball. Ah, man, he has to take better care of the ball. DC, you have to take better care of the ball, brother. Um, I'm not going to get too much on you because we did win that game. But that could have changed things. For sure. Then with those three points that we gave up at the end of the half almost come, came back to bit us in the bite us in the ass. But we won the game. He is on pace for over 4K passing yards, 32 TDs, 4 INTs, and a 69.8 completion rate. Our quarterback has to be in the MVP discussion. If he continues this trend, he has to be. He's a top 10 quarterback right now. Point blank period. Yes, I said it. Shout out to my quarterback, DC4. He gets the first game ball. The second one, our running game. Booker, Sacramento zone, baby. Eight rushes for 68 yards in a TD. He just continues to show why he is a high-end backup to Josh Jacobs. He is a beast. This duo is probably the best duo that we've had in a long time. Booker just looks sweet, man, running behind his. But the way he runs behind his line, the way he hides behind his line, the way he follows his blockers, you just love to see it, man. Shout out to Sacramento zone, D Book. Man, great pickup for us, man. Jacobs, 14 for 65 in the TD. I know it doesn't stand, like that doesn't stand out, but he had a great game, y'all. He got to rest a lot because Booker was doing his thing. We had over 150 yards rushing. Like I said before, DC had 14. Ruggs had one for 10 on a jet sweep. I believe Jalen had three yards. He wasn't really too much big in this game. But our two weeks in a row, y'all, we have over 150 yards rushing, and we won both games. You know why? Because it's bully ball. Two-game winning streak because we're running the ball down our opponent's throats. I love it. Bully ball is in full effect, y'all. I'm loving what we're doing. Shout-out to our run game, and shout-out to that O-line for holding up. We're going to get back to them in a minute. Thirdly, Nick Kwiatkowski, one of my favorite acquisitions in free agency this past offseason. 13 total tackles, 10 solo, one huge stop on Tyrod Ty 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 Taylor for that two-point conversion. That could have changed things dramatically, y'all. That could have been the difference maker, the knife in our heart. But he stood tall, stopped Tyrod right there. Oh, man, that was one of the biggest plays of the game for me, man. He is great against the run. Nick just continues to get better and better week in and week out. Thank God that we have him on our uh, in our linebacking core because outside of him, we're not really getting too much production from anybody. Um, we'll talk about Littleton a little later in another video that I got. But shout out to Nick Wachowski. He for sure gets a game ball. Another one, Isaiah Johnson. We have all, as the nation, been screaming for him to get more playing time. The length he possesses, the height. Man, put him in a slot. Put him in safety. Put him anywhere. Get him out on the field. He had six total tackles. Three solo and two passes defense, one that completely saved the game as time expired. I know the rest were reviewing it for a long time. I have no idea why they were reviewing it. They were trying to find a way to, to give that game to the Chargers. Let's be honest. But Isaiah literally broke up that play, man, and won us the game. Shout out to big play, Zay. My bro, I hope we continue to see you. I've been following you since Utah. Beast. I'm sorry, not Utah. Houston. Beast, beast, beast. Let's get it, man. Big play, Zay. Another one. Our O-line. Parker, Hudson, Gabe, Good, Sam Young, Tom Cable. 
We came in beat up and battered, y'all, in this game. And we only gave up one sack. One sack. Brandon Parker held up on the left side. You know, Sam Young finally held out, played an entire game on the right. Hudson and Gabe were leading. Oh, my God, man. These dudes blocked so great, y'all. It's insane, man. And Denzel Good continues to show that he is a serviceable, you know, O-lineman in this league, man. You love to see it. Shout out to the O-line. Shout out to Tom Cable. He just continues to make. Well, what's the old What's the old term? Make chicken salad out of chicken shit? Yeah, man. Tom Cable continues to do that. Hopefully next week our O-line is 100% healthy and it's not going to be 100% healthy because, you know, Trent Brown is out for at least a month. But I hope, hopefully we get Richie back, man. That's going to be another video that I'm going to be dropping probably later on today or tomorrow. Got one on Richie Incognito. We need our, we need, we need our bully back, man. But, can, man, shout out to the O-line. Two weeks in a row, beat up and battered and still held up, man. Shout out to them. Unsung Hero Awards. Kyle Wilber, special teams captain. Big fumble re recovery on that kickoff. That changed things for us. That won us the game. At the end of the day, that, that gave us a, ch a chance to win this game. I know it ended up turning into three and a field goal. I wish it would have turned into a touchdown so we wouldn't have had to come down to this last play shit. But shout out, shout out to Kyle Wilber. He was fighting for that ball at, in, in, the, in that pile. And um, he came out with it, man. Kyle Wilber, you are an unsung hero, brother. Shout out to you. D-line, two sacks. Unsung hero. We need more than that, though, y'all. We need more. But the only thing I can say is, man, they were after Herbert. It may not have translated into sacks, but they were after him. Very disruptive. Max had a sack. Nassib had a sack. Klee was all over the place, man. Great against the run. Hankins great against the run. Shout out to the D-line. They're continually getting better. Uh, we need more sacks, though. Two is not going to do it. We need, we need four. We need five. We need six. But shout out to my team, man. We did our thing. We did our thing, man. We went on the road, on the road to LA and won a game. Now we back home. Two divisional foes back to back, Denver and KC, both in Vegas. Let's go on a run, y'all. Let's go on a run. Let's go on a run, man. It's your boy, Graphic Raider. The views expressed to our Graphic Podcast. I love y'all nation. I'm going to be back in a minute. One.